Hello, in this problem, we're going to try to evaluate this limit. We have the limit as x approaches 2 of x minus 2, all divided by x squared plus x minus 6. Whenever you have a limit problem like this, the first thing you should do is plug in the number and see what happens. So if we do that, in the numerator, we get 2 minus 2, which is 0. And in the denominator, we get 2 squared, so that's 4, and plus 2 and then minus six. So two minus two is zero. This is zero over, and then on the bottom we get six minus six, which is also zero. So that doesn't work. So we have to take a different approach. Let me show you another way to do it. Solution. There's a few ways of doing this. The most basic way is to try to factor the denominator. Let's try that. So we have the limit as x approaches two. And in the numerator, we have x minus 2. And in the denominator, let's see, this should factor. Maybe it looks something like this. So x and x, because x times x is x squared. Now we need two numbers that multiply to negative 6, but add to 1. So it looks like 3 and 2 should do it. And the 3 should be positive, And the 2 should be negative. Let's check. 3 times negative 2 is negative 6. 3 plus negative 2 is 1. x times x is x squared. So all looks good. And look at this. Boom, it goes away. This is equal to the limit as x approaches 2. And here we have 1 over x plus 3. At this point, we can actually plug in the 2, and there's no funny stuff going on. There's no division by 0. We drop the limit sign. We get 1 over, and then x plus 3, so we have 2 plus 3. And 2 plus 3 is 5, so we just get 1 over 5. And that would be the limit in this particular problem. I hope this video has been helpful to you. Good luck.